What's up, YouTube? This is Jay Millionaire here with a quick video of something that literally just got dropped off. Um, as you can see, it's a human made box because that's what I'm reviewing. Um, crazy thing is, this literally came within a week. And if you know about human made, they come from Japan, or when you order it, it comes from Japan. Um, I ordered some Star Trek uh, merchandise weeks before this. Um, as well as some other human made stuff from BBC um, website and the one from the human made Japan website Came from Japan in a week. It's just amazing to me. So anyways, let's get into it. So I already cut it All right, let's open it up and see what's inside um, So it comes with this human made dry hauls little dog on there a little sheath on the back Of course it says human made dry hauls Just so they can slide the, the invoice in there. It's pretty cool uh, order details, they got me a t-shirt, a black one, uh, another t-shirt in white, uh, duck short pile socks, so short socks, and some briefs. I just wanted to try them out. So everything's in double XL on the shirts because the big size they have, and then XL for the boxers, and then of course the socks, large as they have is large. Uh, and the yen size over here are yen prices, and then of course the subtotal down there. If you want to convert into American UN, US dollars, then you can forgot how much it is but anyway so here is the socks they come in that human made little gears for futuristic teenagers bag and of course the label on here socks themselves so it's just basically human made stitch on there with a duck um has some other human made shirts with ducks on them um, but i just thought it was some nice white socks with ducks i wanted to think the the, the tall socks they already sold out and just like a lot of brands like BBC or Supreme or anything, once the side sells out or the item sells out, that's it. So just got it just because the play down, they're pretty nice. Pretty thick socks. Just like anything else, Human Made uh, makes nice quality socks. But I uh, just got it because the ducks and they're pretty nice. Other thing is just some boxers. Nothing crazy. Um, but let's see what these are about. So of course there's just some gray boxers with human made on there and a heart on there. Um, here's for futuristic teenagers, whatever. And then of course, uh, yeah, inside's just reverse, whatever. But just some gray boxers, nothing crazy at all, literally. Nice thick boxers though, so that's good. Thicker than um, Hanes or regular boxers. So we'll see what these fit like later. And then onto the nicer uh, items that I got. Pretty much just a black t-shirt and then another white t-shirt. Let's do all this stuff out the way. Swing into a tease. The main item is show. The black one, just like the socks, uh, like an item or uh, image that the human made does a lot is a duck. So this one has a uh, human made with the duck and some overalls, look like he's working with the heart there. Uh, I guess their logo on there, it says gear for gears for futuristic teenagers. Um, and then on the back, it just literally has a human made uh, logo with the heart. Again, I got this in double XL and the sizes on human made are literally on the bottom tag. So that's what the tag looks like with the emblem and the other emblem do not tumble dry so one thing about these and i guess the story so i got some other human maids and as you can see it's kind of a thick jersey material so it's very um i guess you can see see-through and flowy and very thick and heavy but one thing you don't want to do is dry it and throw it in the dryer because the holes or the space between the fibers if you are to wash it and then dry it it'll just basically shrink up so won't necessarily shrink width wise it'll shrink uh lengthwise <laughs> so this double xl even though it's already not doesn't start off super long it'll shrink up and it'll be like a high-waisted shirt i have some other ones um they're kind of writing up but i just do with them but i won't make those, those mistakes anymore and hope you don't either um, other t-shirt i have from human made is this emblem right here it is the heart emblem with the little dashes and then of course human made on there it's kind of like an orange uh with a navy hue um kind of looks kind of like a dinerish image in my opinion but i like it so i end up getting it and then in the back has that same human made image in black which is just a staple of their uh, tags in the back again this is uh that double xl 100 cotton and made in japan and do not tumble dry so like i said do not tumble dry these literally just hang them up 
uh, because they will shrink. So that is a couple of things that I got from Human Made. And like I said, they're super quick with the turnaround. Uh, socks again, 60%, I'm guessing cotton and some other stuff because I don't speak uh, or read kanji. But yeah, so um, let me see whatever I, else I have on. Just off top because uh, I have this over there. But this is another Human Made, an older Human Made shirt in... Let's see if I can do some comparisons. Of course, this isn't even onto sizing. So I wear a large, like I said, in Supreme, Nike, pretty much all t-shirts. Everything's a large. Um, with these, I get in a double XL just because of the, the length and width of them. Um, as a comparison, I will get a double XL T from Human Made that I have been washed before, which is shrunk. Then I'll throw in a our, our extra large human made t-shirt that has been washed as well. And I'll show you the difference in the sizing. These are my super old t-shirts. So I've done my own experimenting of what size works well with this brand. And for me, it's the biggest size you can get because it is from Japan. So they run small off top. So I'll give you a comparison just so you know. So this double XL t-shirt, like I said, that's been washed already, shrunk a little bit length and width wise. Um, it says you're not supposed to tumble dry it, and they are correct. <laughs> Literally just hang dry it as best you can. Cold washing. And this is uh, that extra large t-shirt. Just to show you, the blue one on top is extra large, and the one on bottom is a double XL. So let's line these up correctly with the collars and the shoulders. And I've already washed these a bunch of times, so they've shrunk. And I've stretched them out just from wearing them. So they're not 100% accurate from a brand new one, but it's pretty much the same thing. So, showing some things as far as the extra large on top and the double X on the bottom. You can see already the shoulders for where the sleeves are. It's just like an inch off, an inch off, and a little bit smaller as far as the pit to pit. As far as going the lengthwise, you can see on the bottom it is about an inch, inch and a half difference from the XL to the double XL. And like I said, I wear a large, so even the double XL is a little bit shorter. Um, after messing up and washing them, it is super short, so I'll show you that. So for contrast, I'll get this double XL, uh, one I just bought, brand new, has it been washed? Show you just in case you just tuned in, double XL. And I'll throw this double XL that has been washed, um, mistakenly tumble dry as well. Uh, you know, put those up at the collars, same thing. Shoulders, pits, all that jazz. So it's lined up, and as you can see, after washing the exact same size, it's, it's shrunk a bit. Um, the pits, not so much, but the sleeves are shrunk and a little bit um, width and length on the sleeves itself. The width, not so much on the width itself on the shirt. It hasn't really shrunk too much but it has shrunk a little bit. And then the biggest part, in my opinion, that when you shrunk or, or wash it tumble dry is the length of the T. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Well, it doesn't really show up too much because in my opinion, human made tees are super like, I guess, short just because like I said, they're made in Japan. So they're already start short. Um, and the double XL is kind of on the boxy width size because that's just how they're made. But if you do tumble dry it, that it'll, you'll lose about an inch. Doesn't sound like a crazy amount, um, but when they're already short, that, uh, <laughs> that is a lot. So just at the comparison again, this double XL that I've washed and dried on accident, this large that has been washed and probably dried on accident, but it already starts off short. Hard to see this contrast. But as you can see, uh, the XL is already shorter than double XL. So it's about an inch, inch and a half difference on that as well. And the width is about an inch on each side. Pretty hard to see from these white, not the very good contrast. But just to let you know, I wear a large and like I said, Nike is supreme, pretty much everything. Um, and the XL was super short, made it do. And the double XL was pretty short. 
and it's even shorter now because I washed it. So I will <laughs> make sure I don't do that with these or I guess any other human made stuff that I have. But these are the examples of the ones that I messed up in the past. So just giving you guys that so that you don't do it in the future if you were to buy any of these human made t-shirts. But they are very good quality. And like I said, uh, ordered from Japan because they're all made in Japan, but literally ordered from the Japanese website. It's all in kanji and Japanese writing. Uh, and it came within a week from Japan. So that's pretty quick. The quality's on point always with Nigo and his brands. Uh, with Bape and all that jazz. So I can't complain. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe. Like this if you have copped anything from Japan and or the BBC store. Because I have and they take a, a longer, which is surprising. I don't know how or why that is. Uh, but yeah, like subscribe. Peace.